Hello, my name is Tom Stiles, and this is Tom's Radio Room Show number 32. Today's show is a review of one of my radios. It's the Hammerlin HQ110. Um, it's one of vintage. It's a vintage radio, and I have um, a web page that can uh, show you some details about the radio. And then I also have a video that uh, one of my fellow YouTubers uh, did, and it's uh, much better quality than that I could ever do. Plus, his radio is a beautiful radio, and he is his uh, channel. His YouTube channel is N O I R F I L M. R-A-D-I-O, and his name is Jim. He has a number of videos on older radios, and he does an excellent quality of both the review he does and the video he does. So let's go to the webpage first. This is the webpage, uh, radioing.com slash museum, which has a lot of uh, general information about older radios. And here we can see the Hammerlin HQ-110 and the HQ-110A. Now, I've got a number of Hammerlin radios, and uh, I like the way they sound and the way they tune. This particular radio is for ham band only, ham bands only. So it's not a general coverage receiver. Uh, It does tune AM, CW, and single sideband. Um... It originally cost $250 back in 1962 to 1964, weighs 32 pounds, quite heavy, and fairly large, but about the average size for radios back then. And uh, one of the nice features is the clock that it had. I'm not sure all of them had the clock, but uh, the one I have does have the clock. And the nice feature about having the clock is... Not only just the regular clock feature, but also the feature of the fact that you can set up a um, timer so it will turn the radio on at a certain time of the day and turn it off at a certain time of the day. So that's a handy feature. Next, I'm going to show you the uh, video, and um, it shows you uh, a great amount of detail about the radio. The video itself is excellent, and here comes the video. Monday night, AMI net, 
which I guess starts at about 15 minutes, W6OM. Thank you. 